most of my men are optimized at one. TRT uh, and testosterone levels, how much is too much? So uh, I hear you talk about uh, 300 milligrams maximum a week. So what's really too much and the levels? Again, let's see, you know, no one, no one knows what every individual man's sweet spot was when they were 21 or 25 years old, unless they had their testosterone levels drawn back in those days. So that's a gray area. I mean, what is too high for one person may be ideal for another. It's got, but def, definitely, I feel that once you are out of the TRT range, of, once you get higher than 200 mg per week, you're entering into that zone where you're more into you know, cycling it, you're more into high dose. Um, but everybody's different. And some men have uh, uh, what I call testosterone resistance syndrome or, or TRS, and that's quite prevalent now. And obviously, the more xenoestrogens uh, you have in your system, the more likely you're going to need more testosterone uh, to get dialed in. But I've never had a man where I've had to take him above 300 milligrams a week. Mm -hmm. Where and you know, but that's rare. Most of my men are optimized at 160 to 180. Mm -hmm. Now that's sweet spot for probably 85 percent of my guys. Most have to, some go higher than that, some go lower, but I could say 85% of my men over 40 years are dialed into 160 to 180 megs a week. But that leaves us some latitude. Some, I got a lot of men who just want to stay on, you know, 200 megs a week, and they just mess with the divided doses, whether it be twice a week, three times a week, or daily. And what total testosterone levels uh, do those? Um doses give them most men and from my clinical experience are dialed in with now it depends if you measure the trough or peak but most of my guys have to be at a 50, 1500 1200 to 1500 nanograms per deciliter total testosterone which hopefully equates to 25 or better nanograms per deciliter free testosterone mm -hmm. But like we, like I don't know when Danny Bosa had a, a talk on this some time ago. I think he did a survey where most guys that were contributing to your channel uh, contributed the information that most guys are dialed in at thirty-five to forty-five nanograms per deciliter free testosterone. So I think Terry Hertog he says you need to be above twenty-five. My clinical experience, most men need to be 35 to 45 nanograms per deciliter. And again, I have I take the total testosterone to where it needs to be to get to that free testosterone. Yeah. If you wish to support the channel, consider becoming a channel member. And check out the links in the description of all the things I'm associated with. My ebook on compounded testosterone cream, multiple workout programs, Mizumi skincare, online pharmacy NP Labs, and a list of Amazon links to the supplements we recommend.